Okay, we'll make a start. Morning, everybody. Uh, do remember next week it's Bank Holiday Monday, so there ain't no class. Uh, but all the other classes will be running. Uh, just none of the ones on the Monday because it's a Bank Holiday Monday. Uh, so I, I usually use that as an admin day. So just have your feet shoulder width apart and really tune into the ground, lengthen through the spine and just take a few slow deep breaths. So notice the breath as it comes in, notice the breath as it comes out. Notice the elbows and the shoulders and wrists, hips, knees and ankles. Relax around the jaw. Sink the hips and turn the waist to just allow the arms to move. Really let go in the arms. So they're just very relaxed. Just gently breathing in, breathing out, sinking the hips. Lengthen through the spine, relax around the jaw and then raise the arms up, so we're going to go through the um, 18 set and then why tape off as fruit. Through the body, very nice. So just tune into your your bounce and shape, and I got given a a new one today. So this is fresh from this morning. You you come up like that. And then you go like that. I think we'll give that a go. <laughs> Just, I think it's a great move. I learned it from Eva. 
two, three. Let's do one more. Four. So work on that. I think it's brilliant. <laughs> it's really good. Woo. That's great. So that's one that she did. And um, what we'll do, just tune in, tune into the springs in the body. So you want to, you want to check your posture. You want to check your posture. You want to check that you're nice and tall all along the spine. So the, the, um, top of the head just here where i'm pointing in my head that's floating up the sitting bones and tailbone they're all sinking down you so you're sinking your hips you're nice and relaxed you're, you're sinking your shoulders so this bit between here and here and here and here you can almost think of them sort of stretching being being stretched out to the side nice and relaxed so yeah i can really feel my right arm today i've got my jab on saturday and it's still oh it feels a bit weird but never mind it's breathing in and out so just tuning in tuning into the um the natural springs of the body, natural springs of the body, just breathing in and out, and then, so just make your arms soft and light and floating, I'll show you that from the diagonal view, so you're, you're just nice and relaxed, we're very relaxed. And then turn the palms up. And we've got this springy feeling in the knees. So the knees are all nice and relaxed. and change so just nice and relaxed everybody next week is bank holiday monday so you'll there won't be no class it's uh, you'll have to practice <laughs> we'll go and watch a video and do that that will work okay and then
keep breathing and change just let the arms swing And we're all breathing. Very good. So just let the arms swing forwards and back. Well, I've been, I've been asked by the charity that's partially funding this if we've got any um, we could have some snapshots or something so what I might do is near the end I might set up we'll, we'll do like a little routine and I'll do it as a mini video and then we'll um, I can send them because they need evidence so because uh, we're, we're funded until July or partially funded until July um, so keep breathing nice and relaxed in the hands And then we do this. Okay. Shoulder. One, two, three. Four, five, six, seven, and eight. Other direction. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Other shoulder. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Eight are the way. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Shake out. Dragon serves teacups. One, we'll just do ten. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight nine and ten nice okay and then shake out shake out that's it okay let's do uh yeah hands on the hips circle the hips one two three four five six seven eight other direction one two three four five six seven eight let's shake out okay so little little kicks with the with the feet one two three keep the knees soft four five six seven eight and the knees that way and that way that way and that way okay let's go through the 18 and then we'll uh we'll go through the 18 and then we'll have a look at why tape offers fruit um yeah nice and relaxed so just check your posture 
make sure you're moving from this very still quiet place and begin lovely really nice it comes back down again that's right it comes back down again and then it comes up and down up and down And then change. So we come up, we open, we come back and down. Show that from the diagonal. So we come up, open. So these are the relatively quite straightforward and simple movements. There are Qigong sets that are far more complicated. Okay, one more round. And then wave the rainbow. That's it. change part in the clouds just rounded shape in the arms lengthening through the spine Keep breathing. One more round. Show you that from the diagonal view.
one more each side. Rowing the boat to the middle of the lake. So watch the alignment along the spine for this one. And you're floating up through the head. It's more like a kind of punt boat or a, like a gondola boat. That's it. So come round, that's it, now over, and then you come back, that's it. One more. Bouncing a ball up in front of the shoulder. Then one more each side. And then looking at the moon, remember long through the spine. One more each side. Lovely, really nice. Okay, pressing palms or pushing palms. Just check your posture. Check your posture. Check that your your shoulders and your hips are sinking, but you're lengthening through the spine. And then we just do.
Keep breathing though. Make the, the hands very soft and light. And try, try and feel it in the whole of your body. Okay, one more time each side, I think. Yep. <laughs> Wave hands like clouds, Lin Hao, uh, Professor Lin Hao Sheng style. So he has his palm out when he does wave hands like clouds. But there's still that roundedness, sort of almost scooping in at the bottom. Show you that from the side. It's like this. So you want to be nice and tall. And this very soft feel. Keep breathing. Yeah, those of you that are having internet issues, the video will be, I've, I've recorded it, so hopefully the video will be up. Um, I'll try and stick them out as soon as the lesson's finished, actually. So it's uploaded on the Grey Heron Internal Arts channel. So if, you, if you've had internet issues, say you've missed bits, you can actually catch up. <laughs> so it's all cool. Okay, let's do, let's finish this one. Okay, we'll do touch the sea, look up at the sky, because I've not done that one for a while. Touch the sea, look up at the sky. This is not the official version. <laughs> this is the Ronnie Robinson version, which I quite like. quite good because you can use your knee as like a focus point you can um, use it as a as a kind of dot on the map one more time and then other side so touch the sea look up at the sky so this isn't what the professor does. Fabulous. Okay, we'll we'll uh, go back to the official version. Pushing waves. So it's quite positive. I quite like it the way he does it. He kind of comes up slightly at the top, and it feels very positive. So there's actually, I think there's about eight different 18 sets so far. He just cooks new ones up. He, he does a lot of research, sort of Chinese medical research and stuff, and then cooks up these exercises that will be useful for people over since about the 70s, this guy. And he's always quite a cheerful guy as well from the videos I've seen of him. Well, that would make me cheerful too if I, I made something that like millions of people all over the planet were doing. That must be quite cool. But uh...
com amor. Flying Pigeon. And change sides. One more. Back to the middle. Check your posture. One more each side. Flying wild goose. One more. Take a slightly wider start so we'll do rotating like a flying wheel. Okay, one more in this direction and then when you get to the bottom corner we're going to go in the other direction.
Okay. And then bouncing a ball while marching. Press palms in corners. Right, okay, we'll, we'll stop for a quick water break and then we'll have a look at why tape offers fruit, practice it for a bit, and then um, it would be quite useful if we could do a little video of us in gallery view and then that will be, that will satisfy the char charity requirements. I hope everyone's done their hair. So, yeah, have a look. Demonstration. Why tape off as fruit? I'll show it from the, uh, actually, I'll show it along the diagonal first and then we'll do it sideways i'm so glad i'm indoors today it was a bit it was a bit character building out there i was tempted to teach this outside and i did do my training outside this morning but i just thought bruh no i'm staying indoors so um here we go we just start like this we step we part the wild horse's mane we transfer the weight we open we come forward and we come back and we hold the ball and then we do it again. So you just want to do it kind of quite sort of understated really. When, when I've been doing this with the Cascubas, it's been quite, yeah, understated understated so they're not they're not like trying too hard it's all quite quite relaxed and easy going you want to just take it easy let me check am, am i am i recording i think i am oh i am recording okay yeah there was there was one class uh last week no the week before last i'd forgotten to press record so no one knows what happened but never mind never mind so let's uh Let's give it a go. Right, are we all ready? Here we go. So we step, part the wild horse's mane. So we open, then we bring the hands together, fan out, dragon holes a pearl. And we do it the other side. So. Usually when I'm indoors, I've got maybe room for three of these, three, three rounds of this. And you just want to feel that the whole body is moving together with itself. So it's all... And, oh yeah, um...
there's a little tutorial up on the YouTube channel, Seated Dragon Serves Teacups. Like a five minute, five minute tutorial. If any of you want a tutorial on the thing we do in class, let me know and I'll do a little video and put it up on the YouTube channel. Let's do a few more. I think we've got it, haven't we? Okay, um, if, right, just because of the um, charity requirements, if anyone doesn't want to be on the video, just switch your video off and that will be, we're going to do like a minute footage of this. Uh, if you don't want to be on it, just just switch your um, thing off. It's just, because um, if I don't prove I've done something, I'm hoping to get some more funding. So here we go. Let's just try that again. Right. We'll just do a little quick, quick short snippet. Here we go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. One, two, three, four, five, six seven one two three four five six seven okay and then one more line and then that'll be it so keep breathing keep nice and relaxed And one more. Okay, right. I'll put you back on back on pin view. Right, you can come back now, you're quite safe. <laughs> we'll just carry on. Right, nothing to see, nothing to see. Thanks very much. And then I'll be able to take a picture and that and go, look, we did things. You can keep funding us, thank you very much. You know, it's just... So, those of you that come to Ely and Burwell and that, um, I'm hopefully phoning up Jeremy this week and contacting Daniel at the Burwell place to find out if we're back in June. I think it will probably be June, I should think. Which would be very nice. How are we doing? Very good. So we step, park the wild horse's mane. Fan out. Hold the pearl, sink back. We're all breathing. So we'll get to that end and then we'll, we'll change the exercise to, uh, we'll do the walking dragon one, because I like that one. Okay, so now 
we're going to have a look. Uh, I'll just demonstrate it. So demonstration. So this is the one I learned from Tai Chi Dave, one of the many Daves that do Tai Chi that lives in Leeds. Hi Dave. <laughs> Thanks mate. Yeah. So it goes kick and then it comes down. Oh, that was rubbish. Then it comes down like that. And then we go like this. And then we come back. So it's like a silk reeling. And then it goes one, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, six. Simples. How to walk around the shops. You know, for your daily life training. So. Well, I've got a wall in the way, I'll have to... So again, you want to you wanna keep nice and relaxed and just sort of... Not be in too much of a hurry, you know, this is like... It's more about giving yourself enough time and space to do the movement correctly. And we're all breathing. Make sure you breathe. That's quite important that. So you want to breathe in and out and then just it's feeling controlled and relaxed. Well, I've got the bookshelf in the way. Yeah, bookshelf's in the way. Okay, let's let's leave that one. That was so good. Let's have a look at Dragonfly Skims the Water and the Flying Crane. Um, okay, dragonfly skims the water. Just a little reminder. So we're like this, and this one's slightly higher. So the back hand is slightly higher than the front hand. I'll show you that from the diagonal view. So it's a really good one for developing your balance, your uh, getting a better balance. Um, it works, it strengthens your legs, it gently exercises your arms, so it does lots of very useful things. Yeah. Dragonfly skims the water. Here we go, ready. Breathe in and out. And begin. So again, we're not in a hurry. We're just doing our thing. There's been some amazing dragonflies in our garden, actually. It's been great. I love they're brilliant, they are. They fly beautifully, they do. Really nice. Probably them northern, I think it's like a northern darter or something, is that the big one? The, um, yeah, I did buy a book on identification, but I just looked at the pictures. <laughs> yeah. But we, we get the big one, the big uh, northern one. Okay, let's do another round and then we'll, we'll, when we get to the end, we'll do, we'll do the crane. So we go from dragons to insects to birds. Beautiful. Okay, now we'll do the white uh, we'll do the crane. So that's like this. 
down so like that we'll do it static first and then we'll go for a little walk yeah okay you've all got it you're all experts let's go for a walk that was great so again this one works your balance it works your shoulders and your arms Okay, we've got a wall there. Right, we'll go back to the middle. And I notice we're starting to run out of time, so we'll. So these are all good exercises for balance and coordination. Okay, one more, one more. That's lovely, beautiful, everybody. That was really nice. That very elegant cranes going on there. Fabulous. Okay, let's uh, check our posture. So we're sinking the hips, we're relaxing, we're breathing. So nice and tall, sink the hips, relax the shoulders. And we just come back to this one. So just feeling that waist turn. So the, uh, the quad opening and closing and then the yao working yeah oh okay oh we've got five minutes to go okay Breathe in, sink the hips, relax around the knees. Okay, just breathe in, breathe out, breathe in, and out. We'll do one more and then we'll do some of the massaging. Uh, I did some with Ever the other week and I thought, oh yeah, that's good. Yeah, so I'll come a bit closer. So you get your hands, oh, rub your hands together. Yeah, I forgot that bit. Rub your hands together. And then you make like a round shape, a round shape in the hands. So it's like, if you have a look, it's like that. And you press it first. And you have a round shape in your arms as well, and then you tap. You tap your fingers and thumbs together, but keeping the rounded shape. Like if you're playing the piano well, you have this round shape and not look like banana hands. But I have seen some really good piano players that play with banana hands. I just can't watch them. I can't watch them. So, um, right, we've done that one. Now we go like this. So you're just gently tapping around. So this is good for your bone density. Okay, and then you make a, an open shape in one hand and a fist in the other and you bring them together. 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. Then you do the other side so it's not left out. And that rounded shape. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. Like that, like that. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. Other way. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. Interlock the fingers like that and when we go like that. Okay change and massage okay and then tap the shoulder 
three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Down the inside of the arm and up the outside of the arm. Be careful if you've recently been jabbed in your arm. Just, you know. <laughs> yeah, don't, don't hit it on the jab site. <laughs> yeah. It was amazing. Yeah, I got mine done at the Grafton Centre. Big shopping centre in Cambridge. How weird was that? It was amazing. Okay, other side. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. I was very impressed, actually. I thought they were very... Oh, missed the jab site. I thought they were all very nice. And then either side of the spine in parallel lines radiating outwards. Around the hips, down the outsides of the legs, on the feet if you can reach, up the insides of the legs. And then on the chest. Fabulous. Oh. Okay. Right. We'll we'll come back to that in a sec. Let's just do a bit of embrace tiger. And then we're going to look super young this morning. So rub the hands together and polish the face. So you look, think of smoothing out any wrinkly bits. So smooth, like hot caramel or something, all lovely and smooth and really nice and oh. Marvellous. And then and then they rub the hands together again. And then we nice, relaxed and warm lower back. So this would be great. So set us up lovely for tea, won't it? Fabulous. Rule five, know when it's tea time. And then embrace Tiger two more times and then that'll be our lot. Oh. Well, I thought we all looked very good. Nice and tall, lengthen through the spine, sink the hips, relax around the jaw. Make a fist with the right hand, left hand over the top, feet together and bow. Great! Brilliant! Oh, oh, that was great. So remember, next week, bank holiday. No class. <laughs> but, um, but we'll be, you know, do feel free. If you come to this class,